Hey family, what's going on? Klaus here and thank you so much for tuning in. Today we are back on our Town Hall 9 account and we are going to be uh, doing one of our Let's Play episodes and I'm very excited about it because it's actually one of those episodes where the Queen is upgrading guys. We actually upgraded the Queen during the Town Hall 9 live stream for the Balloon Zoom events which is actually I think still going on. I'm not entirely sure but anyway guys let's go out and do some raiding. I have a ton of Dark Elixir which is great because I really need to get this laboratory going and I know exactly what upgrade we need to do guys. If you have not seen any wars lately at a Boston Tea Party Knights of Zion, the witches have been doing some crazy, crazy work. So we need to upgrade these witches and we got plenty of loot for that because I've been boosting like a madman and I've been doing some uh, wall upgrades and whatnot. We got one builder to go, like one builder to fill up. So maybe we could do that today as well. But right now guys, let's go out and let's find a raid. And of course I have no queen. So we got to be a little bit more careful about the bases we have. But let's go find a base and and see how much loot we can find. Oh man, guys, look at this. 3,600 Dark Elixir on this base, and it's the turtle base. If you guys seen the turtle base, it looks like a turtle to me. I don't know. Does it look like a turtle to you? Let me know in the comments. But all right, guys, so we're going to attack this base, and I love it because there is no queen, which is great because the Lunian strategy is it gets destroyed by the queen. So let's attack this base and hope that everything kind of goes like up through the middle, but then to the left. That way we don't have to deal with that sweeper up at the top. So first and foremost, guys, let's put down our uh let's put down our clan castle hound let's also throw down our balloons nice and thick mostly on the left side and then we will start uh we'll definitely start our hay spells early because i want to make sure that we get all the way through this base and uh we get tons of loot because that's why i am here that is what we're doing man that is what we're here for so let's uh let's haste this group over here as well let's rage the uh majority of the core there oh man that is nice that is very nice Oh man, I'm liking this. All right, so we need we need to definitely make sure we get the rest of the loot. So let's rage this uh, balloon group over here. Oh man, I don't think we're gonna be able to get that. Ah, uh, yeah, the balloons died. Okay, we definitely want to make sure we want to try to get this uh, dark elixir out of this drill. I'm not sure if it's gonna happen though. Um, so what we're gonna do, guys, we're gonna use the king to keep the balloons busy, and we're going to distract uh, that archer tower while these balloons come over here and uh, and take out this archer tower. Because mainly what we want, guys, is all these minions and and pups and whatnot to uh, come over here and grab that Dark Elixir uh, drill. So, uh, Archstar goes down. The king is no longer in trouble. And look at all these balloons. There's actually a pretty good group of balloons that came around uh, from the, the from the area. I didn't expect them to go. And they're going to actually wipe out this air defense. Come on, get it, get it, get it. Uh, they didn't. They didn't do it. Fail. Okay. Well, that's uh, that's okay. So we got tons of minions, tons of pups, and we've already got so much loot that it's unreal, guys. I want my king. King, go. Okay. We got a ton of troops coming, but I've got also got a an air defense that is wrecking us right now. That's okay. Perfect. All right. So we got pretty much all the dark elixir. Actually, we did get pretty much dark. We got all the dark elixir, and we only missed out on a little bit of golden elixir, which is totally fine because um, that's I mean. Uh, I don't know. Whenever I'm using Lunian, I, I I only care about golden or like dark elixir. I don't really care as much about golden elixir. I don't know why. It's just like a it's just like a dominate the core of the base type of attack strategy, which I really really like. So that is what is that? Four thousand one hundred dark elixir with an amazing attack strategy. Absolutely love it. And um, I, I I that's what I've been finding. I've been finding a lot of that up here in the master league, and it's been absolutely insane. Now we get about a minute before my king wakes up from boost. So let's check out this attack here. This is against boost. 99 with 4,679 Dark Elixir, a good solid three star on a dead Town Hall 10, which was just gorgeous, guys. So before we go ahead and get into the attack, obviously I'm attacking from the Queen side. I dropped my Lava Hound and the Queen is here. We're going to depend on our minions to take out the enemy Queen. Also, guys, the sweepers, we got uh, sweepers pointing left and right, kind of toward each other in the center, which uh, can be rather tricky, but I always, attack from the, I always attack from the side of these guys, not like right in front of them. So poison spell the enemy queen or on, on, yeah on, on the enemy queen. We've got hay spells all over the place sending these balloons in very quickly. The good thing is that the expos and the infernos are dead. So what that does is that gives us the opportunity to save our rage spell. We don't need a rage spell in the very center, but there are tedsless. So hay spells are down. Uh, rage spell to help out these guys get through this air defense here because I don't really know why I put it right there. I guess I just put it on the biggest group of balloons to be honest with you. And um, 
Yeah, I mean, look at these balloons. There's big groups of balloons everywhere, and they're all gonna kind of come together on this archer tower and then work their way toward the wizard tower and then get the cannon and that's it. Meanwhile, we've got minions and we got, well, we had pups. I guess they all got destroyed. But we had minions everywhere getting all the cleanup on the outside and, um, you know, while these balloons take care of all the defenses. Look at that cannon. No mercy, man. No mercy. That, that's a savage group of balloons right there. And just gorgeous, man. Just absolutely gorgeous. And of course, our, the enemy king gets destroyed. I went ahead and sped up the replay because the rest was clean up. And look at all that loot, guys. Over 400,000 gold anti elixir, 4,000 dark elixir, plus a loot bonus. I mean, that was over 5,000 combined dark elixir for that raid. So that was peachy. I, 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 I didn't mind that attack whatsoever. That was really nice. King is awake now, and the loot is in. Let's go ahead and request. Did I say the loot? The troops are in. Uh, let's go ahead and request for, for troops right quick. And actually, let's see. We got, I mean, we just got 3,600. What about, oh, look at this one, 3,900. Let's see this one. This was actually a tunnel 9.5, which is obviously tunnel 10 without Infernos. And I'm coming at the base from the back end of the sweeper because I did not expect a three star. So I figured I'd come at the base from the side of the um, of the side of the Dark Elixir uh, storage and Dark Elixir drill. Poison spell on the enemy queen there. We got a rage spell in the middle. We also got haste spell sending everything in very nicely. We got some rage pups working on the enemy queen. Haste spell sending everything in very nicely. We got one more haste spell remaining, guys. And um, go ahead and put the haste spell on this big group in the middle just because we really want that expo to go down. So everything works out very nicely. Of course, it's a tunnel 10. It's got extra defenses, so we did not three. But that's totally fine. I, I don't really care if I get the three. All I care about is the loot. So, uh, not, not too shabby. Now, those balloons did get destroyed by some air bombs in the wizard tower. Otherwise, if we would have gotten rid of the, um, the wizard tower and the air defense, it would have been even easier to grab more of the loot. But the good thing is, guys, so many pups, so many minions, and the only Dark Elixir remaining is this Dark Elixir drill, which should come very quickly. Let's go ahead and 4x this and get through this uh, trash ring on the outside. Look at that. Oh, man. Get it. Get it, minions and pups. <laughs> That's funny. All right, so the minions doing their thing. I think I, I actually, what I was doing was I was doing some graphics uh, for, like, the channel and stuff, so I forgot. Like, I forgot I was attacking. So th there's going to be a moment. Look at this moment. Yeah, I straight up forgot that I was attacking for like 30 seconds. And I was like, oh, wait, wait, I got my king. So I went ahead and put my king down, put a pop special ability, ran out of time. It was really a waste of time, but it's okay. No big deal. So the loot was amazing that time as well with over 4,500 combined Dark Elixir with the loot bonus. And um, just having some great success up here in the Master League. If you're a Tunnel 9, I recommend it. I mean, like I said, I'm finding some great, great luck and some great bases. Now, I didn't get any troops. Oh, I did get troops. I got balloons. Nicely done. Thank you, uh, clan mates. You're the best. You're the absolute best. All right, let's go. <laughs> let's find another base. <laughs> and check out this juicy base. This is actually the first search. I looked at it for a while thinking, okay, there's a lot of uh, factors in this base. But the good thing is, yeah, we only got a level 10 uh, queen, which is great. And the expos appear to be on ground, which is awesome. So what we'll do is we're going to attack this base from the queen side. Look at all the gold in the storage. Isn't that pretty? That's so pretty. So we're going to get all that, hopefully. And we're going to come in from the top left-hand side to come at the, the blind of that sweeper and after the queen first. All right, we've got clan castle max balloons. I'm actually going to hold on to them in case we have a situation where we need them. So four-finger deployment just like so. We'll spread those balloons up very nicely. Put down the minions as well. We're going to make sure we get a good spread for the cleanup there. And then we'll also set send in our hay spells. I have an extra poison, which is, I guess, fine. Um, so that, that's something to consider and we got all of our balloons going in on one side Which is unfortunate. So let's go ahead and send in the max balloons on the other side and Then I guess we'll, we'll keep hasting these guys and see what happens. Um, the enemy queen is down, which is great Let's uh, let's drop rage on these max balloons because we really really need to get that dark elixir That is why we're here. That's why we came here. This is why I joined the group I mean, this is why I'm here at this party so I can get the dark elixir so now I've got some distracted defenses with that king. King's gonna go in and keep everything nice and distracted while these minions do their thing. Also, we got some balloons still alive down here, but not for long. Look at all that. Look at all that splash damage, guys. That is rough. Pop King's ability. He should get ahead. Work on getting that archer tower. And guys, these minions are just OP. I love it. Oh, yeah. And those are upgraded minions, guys. The last Let's Play episode that I actually did, I upgraded the minions. These are done. Level 5. Just super, super strong. So much better than before. So the king dies, unfortunately. Um, we're able to get a lot of this base. Like, we're going to probably get, what, 80%? 79%? Yeah, that's... Oh, we're going to definitely get 80. Look at this, buddy. Look at that guy coming in the clutch, grabbing that 80%.
Not that it really matters, but that was pretty awesome. And minion working on this. Look at that. No, the, the the wizard, the archers don't know what's there. It's like it's like they're blind. It's like the fog of war is keeping them blinded. And look at this guy. Now he's gonna troll the king. Look at that. Troll that king, dude. Oh man, what minions OP. Earlier, actually, if I can find the replay, I want to show you guys. But I had one minion sit on a dark elixir storage and the town hall for like two minutes of the raid, and nothing could touch it. And it was just sat there. It was the only troop left, and I just watched it just just take loot. It was Awesome. Let's see if we can find that replay right quick, because that is totally worth watching. All right, guys, I found it. It's the attack against Lucas, and this is actually what I was talking about earlier, is actually holding on to your clan castle balloons in case you need them. I mean, just the attack we just did, it mattered, but in this case, too, this is a ring base. It's a very nice star-looking base, like a fat star base, and I'm using my king to take out the enemy queen. We had a poison spell, so that's the only reason why he succeeded at that. We're gonna draw, we're gonna throw our balloons down here, and I want you to notice something. So I laid down my, my haste spells on either corner first, right? We'll go, there's a, there's one haste, there's another haste and what that's supposed to do is create a funnel so that we get a group of balloons that go into the middle and that does not happen so we have balloons good groups of balloons going on either side and that's great so i went ahead and deployed my clan castle balloons later so that they can go into the core and they're going to be untouched i actually laid down a haste spell right in their path to get them there quicker and then put a rage spell on top of the core so we've got uh, again a ring of balloons or balloons going around the ring but also we got some max balloons in the core that are cleaning everything up now what i mentioned was that a single minion was the real mvp of this raid and let me show you that, let me tell you that this was amazing this is him right here leroy thank you sir you're the best his name is Leroy. So Leroy, I mean, there's a lot of there's a lot of stuff going on, but Leroy doesn't care. All right, those balloons just came in. There's an air defense that doesn't see him, and he's gonna sit there for over a minute and a half, and he's gonna single-handedly take out the entire town hall and the entire dark elixir storage. It is just awesome, guys. We got a whole bunch of Leroy's over here. Is that the minion's name now? So we got a whole bunch of Leroy's over here working on stuff, but they're gonna get shot down because there's an archer tower. Let's just be fair. But there is a single minion. And let's watch. All right, they're gone. They're gone. Nothing else going on. And look at Leroy. Look at him doing his thing, guys. He's just sitting there spitting at this thing somehow. Acid burning that town hall. It's just amazing, guys. And he takes out this town hall. And this is the amazing thing. The amazing thing is that he works. Now that that town hall is down, he got that two-star for us. He's going to work on this dark elixir storage for the next minute and... And he's going to work on this for the next minute. At seven seconds before the end of the raid, he finally gets every single drop of that Dark Elixir and starts working on that clan castle. So Leroy OP, definitely, absolutely amazing, guys. I love this guy. So we're going to go ahead and just watch him just soak up the loot. Look at that Dark Elixir just getting soaked up right there. One of the most amazing minion moments of my life. I love it. Take it out, buddy. Nicely done. He's going to get it, and he's going to move down to the Clyde Castle, and then we'll time out. So, nicely done. Awesome job. Got all the loot. Now let's spend some of it. Let's go back to our base. Again, guys, Town Hall 9 Let's Play. Having a blast with this, this account. And now we're over at our progress base, guys. Our queen is upgrading for the next three days. So, definitely be looking forward to maybe some level 13 queen walk. Or 14. What level is she going to? She's going to level 13. So I'm going to be trying some level 13 queen walk in the next episode. That's going to be a lot of fun. But right now, guys, let's get this laboratory going. It finished off uh, earlier today. And I was like, yeah, we definitely need to get this laboratory going again. So first things first, guys, the witch. Guys, if you have not seen the WSWD attack strategy, I've teased about it several times. I will have a guide up for it. But you re it really does require level 2 witches to do it. But it's a town online witch attack that can 3-star any base. I, I can say that with confidence because it has really turned our our clan around. We used to struggle at 10 on 9. Now we're not because of that strategy. W S Oh, wait, um, MSMD, monkey see, monkey do. Did I say W? It's M, MSMD, monkey see, monkey do. Nothing's out on it yet because it's a brand new attack strategy we're putting together. So hopefully uh, we'll be able to get a guide out for you guys very soon. But at this point, guys, 75,000 dark collector, 10 day upgrade. Let's get this thing going in three, two, one, bam. Nice, guys. And 75,000 Dark Elixir down the toilet. Now we have 74,000 remaining. Actually, we could technically upgrade the king, but that means we'd be out of war even longer. So I think I'm going to hold on to my Dark Elixir. And I don't have any Elixir upgrades that I need to do, so I guess I can spend some Elixir on uh, walls. So let's go ahead and get some walls done. That's uh, that's going to be four walls, actually. So let's let's uh, kind of notch this baby out. That's the fourth one. Yeah, Nenny. All right, so that's the fourth one. The fifth one. Here we go. Four million electron walls in three to one. Bam. 
Nice. All right, so now we need to figure out what gold upgrade we're going to do. And I think this Tesla would be a fantastic addition to our base just because it will be the last max Tesla that we're going to have. They're useful, lower weight. So 3.5 million gold. And uh, do I have anything in my treasury? I guess that's the question right now. Oh, my goodness. I've got treasury. I've got treasury loot. I could do more walls. That's awesome. All right, let's collect all this. Let's do one more wall with the elixir. Three, two, one. Bam. Nice. All right. And then let me see. Wait, wait, wait. Three, four. Yeah, we could do two more walls with gold. That is amazing. So let's go ahead and do this one. I'm not going to count anymore, guys. Bam. And one more. Bam. Awesome, guys. So we did plenty of walls today. Now let's get this hidden Tesla going. 3.5 million gold. 10 day upgrade once again. So the Tesla will be done when our witches are done. And uh, we'll have an open lab, which means we'll probably need to do another Tunnel 9 Let's Play episode. So let's do this in 3, 2, 1. Bam. All right, guys, and we're completely broken. Everything except for Dark Elixir. Again, guys, I wanted, I could have easily done the king, put him down. It's only 55,000. We got 81,000, but I'm going to hold on to that. Maybe we could do both of our heroes next episode. That'd be kind of awesome. But at this point, guys, that is going to do. Oh, this is an elixir upgrade. I could have. Oh, man, I forgot about the drills. All right, well, we'll be, we will get it next time. That is going to do it for today, guys. Enjoying the heck out of Lunian. Uh, still getting tons of loot. Pushing. Uh, without really trying trophy pushing up into uh, you know through the master league we might even hit champion league for all I know it's gonna be a lot of fun but at this point guys that is it for me hope you're enjoying it let me know down in the comments how you're farming your title nine if you have one or whatever it is that you might be doing uh, so like this video if you liked it subscribe join the class family if you have not done so already let's get some witch hype down in the comments and that is it for me I love each and every one of you and I will see y'all again next time